guys if you're looking for installing one ui on any of your android device then you're at right place in this video i'm going to share with you how you can install a custom one ui on any of your android device with just easy steps look at this wallpaper this is from samsung the icon pack is from samsung home ui looks like the samsung even the volume slider is inspired from samsung let me show you this one's the volume slider from one ui 3.0 also your notification panel is also also from one UI if you also want these kind of things on a device without installing full one UI custom room how you can do that in this video I'm gonna share with you the whole steps make sure to watch this video till end the video is quite interesting let's get started guys by default the UI which you get on your device is maybe look like this the default home screen default launcher everything seems to be normal here how you can customize like your volume panel which it might be this kind of thing or something different if you're using a xiaomi device the volume panel your quick settings or everything seems to be the stock android kind of things how you can customize and make it look like feel like same one ui you just need some apps and for those apps the first thing which we have in mind is the launcher yes the launcher is the first step in this thing so just install a launcher from the google play store the link for this file is in the description you can simply move on to the play store and install this latest launcher called launcher so we have applied this launcher right now and after installing this launcher now it's you are okay to customize your device how you can customize that let me tell you one thing one by one all these things first of all the main thing is the wallpaper how you can customize the wallpaper i have an app called lit walls you can customize these wallpapers from any other app also but if you open the lit walls app you'll see the app you'll see the wallpapers according from some devices like redmi note 9 redmi note 9 5 you'll get all the stock wallpapers from all these devices and like this we have the samsung device options available here too so we're gonna search for the samsung wallpapers so if we choose the search wallpaper like samsung if we search the samsung wallpaper you'll see all these samsung wallpapers are available previously i had applied the samsung m series wallpaper to show you so you can apply other wallpapers also galaxy s20 wallpapers options are available here too galaxy m31 galaxy m31 these are stock wallpapers so i'm going to apply this galaxy m31 wallpaper so just click on apply wallpaper set as home or lock screen or whatever else it will take some time to download and then you'll be able to install this wallpaper on your device so let's wait for it to download first so that after that it will be applied successfully it will download two times in my case it will download two times uh, firstly previously i've tried that it was started downloading for two times i don't know why maybe it's downloading two wallpapers okay so as you can see it's applied now if i open the home screen you can see this kind of home screen i have right now which has this samsung wallpaper now the thing is the icon pack how you can customize the icon pack as expected the one ui icon pack is also available in the link is in the description is available on the play store so just open your home set settings go to your theme option and here have the option to customize the icon pack one ui icon pack option is available like this you if you have ever seen the one if you have ever saw the one ui home screen the samsung devices one e home screen you'll not see google search bar here you'll see the google search bar here so how you can customize that one just open your home settings once okay now here what you have to do is just go to your dock and here you have to disable this show search bar and just go back and you will see there will be no search bar now available at the bottom of this home screen how you can add that just open your widgets option from here just choose the google search bar from here like this one choose or place wherever you want to resize it according to your preference and now it's done this is the default home screen which you get in samsung also you can customize the opacity of this launcher very easily just going to home settings you can simply move on to your drawer and you can customize the opacity to whatever else you want to you can choose 90 80 or whatever depends upon you so we applied the 88 or 90 approximately this is the opacity which we have right now now all these things are done now other thing which i just extend which i just experienced was the volume panel i have a video on this app which is called volume styles i just uploaded yesterday if you haven't checked it out you can check out that one too so just open this app and customize a lot of things just open style Start and grant all the required permissions which it requires from you allow and after that you can choose the one ui3 like this and now 
if you choose your volume slider this one is from one ui3 volume slider this is quite great you can also customize this slider if you want to we have a lot of customization features available so new volume slider from one ui the wallpaper is from one ui icon pack is from one ui launcher is also customized everything seems to be done now only one thing left which is called notification panel how you can customize that one the app is available on the play store which is called one shade i have a video on this one too i just made a video some time ago so just grab and all the required permissions which it needs so just after all after applying all these permissions like notifications or whatever else just click on ok and now you'll see this kind of layout on your default device so this looks amazing and after doing all these things you'll see that your device will look like one ui not by this but by this yes it will look like this one ui notification shade wallpaper icon pack volume panel everything seems to be same like the one ui which looks great and amazing and like this you'll be able to install one ui custom skin on any of your android device it was quite easy to install it was quite great kind of things if you like it don't forget to like and share this video thanks for watching goodbye